Welcome to Wernex family and welcome to Nairobi. We decided to finally take a family weekend away and just chill. Yeah, we're not working this weekend. We're just here to enjoy and we're gonna film our experience here. And we wanted to take the opportunity to talk to you guys about what our plans are for not only the rest of this year, but going into next year. Because there's been some speculation. There's been a mention of the baby yeah. as well. We'll also take you around Nairobi. We're gonna to go to some cool places with it, yeah? Anyway, all right, let's head out for the day. It's time for breakfast. Um, so guys, I've been following this page on Instagram for ages. It's called Shokupan, and it's an Asian-inspired cafe with like Japanese, um, pastries and stuff like that and I really you're very want excited to check it out. yeah I've I know nothing about this place so I've been drooling over their page for ages and today is the day to make it happen let's go you're gonna have the chocolate one about what you ordered there. So this is a, a croissant. It's been pressed in a waffle maker and then it has cheese, poached egg, seaweed. It passes the drip test. Finished our food, we're both pretty full. Mm. Okay, so we decided to bring Malia to the jungle, <laughs> which is at the um, Insider Center where the bowling place is. <laughs> Are you having fun? Woo! Ready? Set? Let's go! <laughs> uh, it's been a long day. Welcome to the beautiful Karen Gables Hotel in Karen. Well, it's been a bit of a long day, we're a little bit frazzled and we are desperately in need of some lunch. But first, check out the view from our room here mm -hmm. Karen Gables. Thank you so much. Chips. What have I got? I've got peach. I've got um, tuna, tuna sandwich. I'm a little bit too excited about this because I love a garden. Hi. Hi. You want to come exploring with us? Yeah. Okay. Seeing the garden here at Karen Gables is essentially its own ecosystem. Rivers all around me now, just different kinds of plants. And hmm? Can I get a massage here? Yeah. Yeah. So it means I don't have to do it. <laughs> the way I would like it is if we mix it. Should we try these? Ones? Yeah, yeah. This is how it looks sprinkles. <laughs> Do you want to know something cool? Hmm? Daddy saw something yesterday hmm? that I think you'll like. We'll just kind of find things to do as we go along. So yeah, you saw something along the way at the waterfront, right? Mm -hmm. So we're going to stop via and then later on today we're going to do a brunch, which I'm so excited about because we don't have brunches in Watamu. Yeah, that's it. No. <laughs> Ow! I think we should be heading out. Please. If we were going to have another baby, yeah. what should we call our baby? Everyone's going to say a Kenyan <laughs> name, obviously. Exactly. Why not? Okay, all right. So Let's a boy's call. name and a girl's name for our hypothetical baby. <laughs> I can't believe you're going down this route. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're here. It's a small amusement park right next to uh, Magi Magic. Yeah, but at the waterfront. Uh, they have like two rides and they have this slide thing behind, which maybe she'll have fun on as well. 
and it's 400 per person. So for me and her to take a ride on this thing, it's going to be 800 shillings. Let's just make it one ride and go, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> you look like you're struggling. She's done. <laughs> You enjoyed it? Uh, not so much. <laughs> go on, on the pirate right. ship, let's go. Yeah. Malia, how was it? Not good. Why? Made you feel sick. That lasted approximately <laughs> 0 0.01 seconds. Yeah, it's like I could feel how you could get a bit queasy in this. All right, what's right. next? Oh, we're just gonna go out with coffee at CJ's. We're here, so we might as well stop for a, a minute and then we'll continue. I don't know, we're just gonna do a bunch of random things today, <laughs> so stay tuned. <laughs> so this is mine. It's like the size of your head. Is it really? <laughs> okay, Malia. Wow, that's a big piece. <laughs> I'm not the biggest piece. The hub. It's actually a nice place, actually, because I like that it's kind of all sort of outside. Malia can go in there, spin around in the cars, and then we can take it in turns to go and have a look nice. in a couple of shops and things so it's, it's always a nice vibe here so we were just talking about the fact that we really enjoy coming to the hub and then actually we came up the back we've never walked off the back before and they've got this cool lake with oh garden. gardens you can go on the zip lining course and then they have this cool thing over here where you can jump from this tower into this airbag so Ina's now going to try uh, <laughs> no, no I'm not with our escapes we've done a lot of cliff jumping Mama, but this is next level <laughs> We should ask our audience, who do you want to jump, me or Adam? By the way, for the record, we've been told time and time again, oh, it's so cold in Nairobi at the moment, duvets. bring duvets and jackets. It's like British summertime, 20 degrees, sun's out, beautiful. Sorry, Nairobians, but we disagree. Mm. Um, so it's brunch time. And we're going to Barista and Co because we hear they've got brunch. I'm quite hungry, so let's go. Like the, the menu, there's so many things that I want to try because it's all very unique here. We kind of want to sample everything. Mm. I might need your assistance for this. So what is this one? Kino salad. Kino salad. Caesar salad. Hummus, shakshuka. And that's and basically. This is just the bread for the hummus. Got the poached eggs inside the, the hummus, which is very interesting. I've never had that before, but everything looks unreal. Thank you so much. First things first, always hummus. Um, really, really, really. Really, really good. Highly Amazing. recommend it. Very much. And guys, by the way, let us know. If you want to see more of like food stuff, I love eggplants. Really good. Yeah? You like it. These are crispy cauliflower. So good. Welcome to my channel. You're going to show us around? Yeah. Television. Television, that's your favorite. Bedroom. Bedroom. How big is the bed? Very big. Some bouncy surfaces. A working area. The bathroom. Is it nice and big? Yeah. We're staying in room number one. It has a really good view of the swimming pool and the gardens and uh, this, this property as a whole has eight bedrooms. When we first arrived, really liked the kind of old style of the property. It reminded us a little bit of my parents' old house. You built it from scratch to feel like it was an old property, which it absolutely does. That's a very good job. Yeah. It's time for us to finally sit down and talk about our plans for next year. So, you guys were right, we're having a <laughs> no, but for some reason, everybody seems to think that we're having another baby. First and foremost, we are not having another baby yet or uh, planning to at any time soon. So that one we can completely get rid of. Gone. But we are planning at the end of this year to leave Kenya. Kenya. But not forever. No, so prior to moving to Kenya, pre-COVID, some of you will know we had a global travel company, an adventure travel company, uh, where we used to meet with groups of people all over the world and take them on cool adventure holidays. Kenya was one of those locations and it's how we first connected with the country. COVID happened, everything went on hold, everything stopped and we thought where can we go and spend some time that we really love and that ended up being Kenya and that's why we ended up here. We originally came for a two month holiday, ended up staying by the time we leave for two whole years and now travel has resumed, life is back to normal and our plan is to, well we are resuming our travel company going into next year which will mean that we are spending a lot more time in lots of different countries.
much. But first, let's show you what that looks like and uh, what we're planning to do next year. And hopefully, some of you guys can join us. Are you yeah. ready? I would say this this is not an ad, but this absolutely this is, is an, an ad. ad. This is an ad. Three, two, one. Let's go. So that is exactly what it is that we are going to be going and doing next year. We're going to be running approximately five adventure escapes next year all around the world. And if you're interested in coming on one of our escapes, please do check out Where Next Escapes. We'll put links in the description and maybe a little card at the top here somewhere. Now, we want to say as well, this does not mean that it is over for Kenya. As much as we are leaving in December, we are already planning a, a trip back here in February to come back and do exactly what we're doing right now. And but do and things a little bit time. more on our own terms as well, because up until this point, he has been working. Our time has been a little bit limited and we were just not always able to do what we love doing, which is, you know, the reason you guys are here is because we share a lot of cool travel adventures with you. And we hope you're gonna stay tuned because next year we're just sharing a lot more on a global scale. It means that when we come back to Kenya, we're only gonna come back to explore, travel and experience the country on our own terms. So that's actually very good news for you and for us. We're but super excited to actually come back on our own terms. Now we come back just for us. So stay tuned for tons of crazy content from all over the world in places like Thailand, Bali, Sri Lanka, Costa Rica, which actually Costa Rica I'm going to in October. So I'm going to film a vlog, a little taster of what you guys might get to see in the future. So as well, what you guys will start seeing probably from within a few vlogs is a few international videos, starting with Costa Rica. We're going home for Christmas um, and it's time to reunite with our families again. So you're going to see some stuff from the UK. We're going on a snowboarding trip. So we're just moving a little bit more internationally, but that doesn't mean that we're so, so yeah, the exciting things ahead. We hope you're excited to see that content. I'd love to know your thoughts. What country you would love us to visit most in the world? Write a but comment also, down below. let us know. Is anyone going to join us? Because that would be really cool. If you guys ended up on one of our escapes because of us, that would be amazing. And I think it's worth mentioning this in this vlog as well. We are planning to run the first three escapes um, and the last two, uh, which is Costa Rica and Sri Lanka, will be run by a team because we're planning to come back to Kenya during that period uh, towards the end of the year. So if anyone is joining us, join us in the Philippines, Thailand or Bali, those three destinations. Just drop us a DM and double check with us if you're coming away with us, but we would absolutely love to have you guys. So now we're gonna chill, we're gonna watch a movie, and then Malia and I are off back to what time we're in the morning. This one is off somewhere, gallivanting around. Is Exploring. Another property. And now stay tuned for some more Karen Gables stuff. stuff. <laughs> now we're just waiting for some dinner. It's gonna be an early night, we have an early flight tomorrow. I got the beef again. And mine is fish with roasted potatoes and some veggies. And mine is eating cornflakes for dinner. Okay, it's the end of the day. It's the end of our weekend here in Nairobi. And Ina's going her own way from tomorrow. I'm going back to our town with Malia. Hopefully you've enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please don't forget to like. If you're not already subscribed to our channel, please help support us and subscribe, comment, and do all those things that help us grow our channel. Good night.